Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here bright and early this morning. Going to start a new project that I've thought about doing, and it's going to be a bird bath. Kind of a big oblong bird bath. Not real deep, shallow. And I'm not going to tell you what I'm going to use for a mold yet. You'll have to wait and see. <laughs> So, I'm going to uh, go go around here and gather a leaf. One, I, oh, I think all I need is one. So, I'm going to go around here and get it and uh, start my project and mix up my cement. Portland cement and Georgia sand is my ingredients. So, Thank y'all so much for watching this video. Have a blessed day. Subscribe and share. And be a blessing to someone each day. Thank you. This is my flowers that I have growing in my backyard. I have a lot of butterflies. and I have not good pictures, but I have sugar cane growing in my backyard that I planted. <laughs> I'm proud. I love sugar cane. I'm from the south. Here they are. have some giant <laughs> leaves and this is my uh, this is a canna lily a yellow one and this banana trees back here I have had bananas I guess I'm gonna take that one big leaf right here take this one. That is a big leaf. There's my flowers. There's my woods. Okay, that's all. Okay. I'm putting my Portland cement in. Make much dust if you can help it. Eight cups, and this is eight cups of Georgia sand. Sixteen, sixteen cups of sand. Okay, mix it up. Try to get it stirred up as good as you can. your water in. I want my cement kind of thick today. That's not enough water. Okay. Hey, does anybody know what this is? 
This is an old satellite dish that I found. Oh, I painted it. <laughs> uh, I'm going, this is what I'm going to use to make my, my mold for my bird bath. Now I'm going to put the cement in it. I'm going to put some cement in here and get started. Spreading it out. We'll have to see. As I go, what I'm doing, <laughs> I don't even hardly know myself. This is a big dish. I want it good and thick where it won't break. Oh, this is a lot of fun if you if you bored and you don't have anything to do just get you some Portland cement and get you some sand and get out here and start mixing up cement and see what you can make I didn't even know that I could make it <laughs> I just started uh, this craft stuff uh, last August, I believe, is when I started in 2016. I never tried to mix any cement. You can, you'll be surprised at what you can do if you get out there and start mixing and trying new things. And This right here, this what I'm doing now is something new to me. I've never, uh, this is a, like a different project. This is a bird bath, but it's uh it's not the way I usually do them I usually mound up the sand and then put the leaf over the top and put the cement over that but this time that's not what I'm doing I'm putting the cement down first and I'm gonna put the leaf over the top and then sink. You never know what I might do. I don't I don't even know myself. I just start doing something and try to figure out what it's gonna be. And it's fun. <laughs> it's fun getting out here and playing in mud. I've lived most of my life working, and I'm retired, and I live alone now.
was going to put some saran wrap on my hand and try to spread it kind of smooth if I can. wetting my brush a little bit to try to smooth it out where it'll take all the impressions of the leaf. Okay, I've got my stem. I think my leaf is bigger than my my thing here. I may have to cut it down some. Now I'm putting the sand on. This is not like any I've made. <laughs> I don't even know if it's going to work. Because I've not made one like this before. I just went up this morning in my road and gathered this sand so I could use it on here. It's still a little damp, but it's okay. It don't matter. I just want it to be heavy and weight down that leaf some so the in, impressions of the leaf will be on here. I think I'm going to just cut some of these leaves off. This works. Okay, I'm going to let this dry. I don't know how long it's going to take, but when I think it's dry, I'll, I'll take it out of the mold and I'll video it so you can see what's happening. <laughs> so, thank y'all for watching this video. I hope it works. Good morning. I'm Helen from Georgia, and I'm out here going, I'm, I made a bird bath uh, a few days ago, and I'm out here to take it out of the mold this morning and see how it turned out. <laughs> uh, I, I made it a different way, so I don't know how it's going to do. We'll have to see together. And I'm going to put a little clip in my uh, video this time of some red birds. It was out here uh, eating and stuff when I was out here. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let y'all see that too. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. Have a blessed day. Subscribe and share. Thank you.
Okay, as y'all remember, I, I, this was a old satellite dish that I had, and I decided to use it for a mold for my bird bath, and I put a elephant ear leaf in it to create the impressions on the, let's see if I can get it out. I think I need to get the dirt out first. From what I see, it looks like it's doing okay. Pull this out. This is my first time ever doing this. I, I really have never seen one done this way, but I know probably someone has done this, but I haven't seen them, but I just thought this up whenever I found this old dish out there. I was going to try to use it. Okay, let me, let me sweep, sweep this other sand off if I can. Goodness. Oh, I think it done great. Ooh. <laughs> I think this done great, but I ain't got it out of this thing here yet. So I don't know. Let me see what I got to do. I need something to. and I can't find mine. edges you can chisel off. This is about more than one person 
chicken. By myself. see it. <laughs> I'm going to clean this. Lay this up here. done absolutely beautiful. All the things, the stems and everything that was in there is in there. I'm going to have to wait till I find my, my chisels to kind of level off the edges, but isn't that beautiful? Let me show you the back of it. I've decided to paint the bird bath. I'm painting it with acrylic paint. Okay, I'm going to paint. to move because the sun was in our other place too much and it was too hot so I'm I'm in another spot I don't know why my birds aren't coming out much I think there's some hawks around here that's maybe trying to kill them I've heard some making hawk sounds out here. I don't I don't like hawks and my birds don't either. that I put on here really work well. You can see very good where the leaf was laying. Don't even hear a bird.
Okay, I'm I'm finished painting it. I'm gonna let it dry. 